Well, police departments work every year to give people a safe space to dispose unused medication. The Hamilton County Coalition took that one step further today to also provide some information on opioids. Channel 3's Angela Kim has more on how they did that. It's almost an epiphany when they understand how the addictive brain works, how trauma works, and, um, and how the addiction hijacks the brain. Vanessa Spots is one of a group of people working to provide education about opioids. One of the things we know is that a lot of those chemicals cannot be filtered out. She and the Hamilton County Coalition gathered at New Home Church to teach people in both English and Spanish about opioids and to provide some resources as well. We're providing uh, naloxone, which is the only medication that will reverse an opioid overdose. So ultimately our goal is to try and meet the needs of people in a variety of ways. The education came through a presentation, a drug disposal site, and stations for people to take home more information. Spot says at the end of the day, giving people these resources and education is a top priority. So that's ultimately our goal, is to make certain that people just don't die as a result of uh, too much of an opioid uh, entering their system. Reporting in Chattanooga, Angela Kim, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Well, this isn't the only presentation that took place. To learn about future opioid education presentations, you can visit the Hamilton County Coalition's website. We'll have that link on our website and, of course, inside our WRCB app.